Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Prison Architect and the frozen hell hall of Hoth where our new facility is now situated. In the previous video we planned off this which is the original idea for our cold prison I guess we could call it and the original idea was to have a central compound that was very secure where the prisoners would never go in and the staff would be able to fulfill all their needs in there so instead of having it over here we thought we'd put it in the centre just for something different you understand you know this is not the ideal way of doing it far from it but I thought it would be quite interesting and indeed I think it is. Um, the problem though is that we had sort of feature creep and we added more stuff and we started to run out of room and admittedly I probably should have built this thing on a medium size map but uh, well I didn't and now it's now so um, we're gonna have to deal with it because of that. We don't have all of the buildings that we need, but that's not a big problem because there's some buildings that we can uh, leave off for the time being. Um, and we only have a total of 20 prisoners uh, for in the cell block A and B, so that's nowhere near enough for the size of thing that we have, especially when you consider, I think, each one of these kitchens and canteens can cater for, I believe it was 80 prisoners each, so 160 in total. So yeah, it means that our expansion to the north and down south will be quite prompt, I would imagine. Either way, we are going to crack on this episode and start getting some grand done let's go over to our walls and doors and over to the white wall and we want to place the white walls all the way along here now this is something that i have uh, not attempted for a strange size building like this so hopefully it will function let's go over to a what should we have a large jail door or do you want a staff door no, a large yield door should be sufficient. So we're going to max speed this out, and it is the new max speed times 10. I know a couple of people were uh, concerned that it is actually a little bit fast for when we're playing the game, and you do miss some stuff out. I agree. I think we'll probably go with that speed when we're actually playing when there's prisoners, but we'll see how we get on. So as you can see, the uh, staff have now finished all of this, and what we'll do is got foundations, building brick, and we can then easily go there, and then along to there, and then along to there, and it will not then overwrite the walls, but it will fill in with foundation in the centre, and then that will be a building with the correct wall. So... That's the way of doing it, basically. And I'm hoping that the bug that people have mentioned is not in the game, and it is brilliant. So you can see that all of this planning has now been removed. Um, that is a bit of a problem. So they've placed all of this, and it's removed it, because when you place foundation over stuff, it uh, gets rid of the planning. Brilliant! Uh, it means that it's a good job we didn't really do much of this either side. Ooh, it's uh, minus 9 degrees and snowing. Cool. <laughs> Literally cool. Uh, so let's go over to our, once again, the uh, walls and doors white wall and we're going to place in the um well we'll place in this sort of bit here our administration centery bit and we probably oh do we need to fill the needs straight away i'm not too sure obviously it has been auto lit i'm going to go for we might as well go for staff doors i mean we could just go with standard doors you understand but we are going to go with the staff doors um all the way along like so and then there perhaps okay so those are now in we will go over to our objects and then actually no rooms office we will designate that as an office and we'll build this one first so we're going to go over to final cabinet we'll place a final cabinet at the top there we're going to say the new chair you can see we now have a lovely um <laughs> a lovely chair for the uh people who like things being nice and centralized like me so there we go that's now in and that should probably that should probably do it so we have our filing cabinet in there and we have the office desks and so forth let's go over to staff and then to warden and hire our warden it says require office uh, that is being delivered that's now a warden's office we're going to go over to bureaucracy and start researching finance finance will then be able to give us the accountant and then obviously that means that we can get that grant done and then start getting some of the other ones so there is most of that done so that is now in it is concerning that you saw the things being removed. We'll have to deal with that. Let's go over it once again here. And this is where we're going to have our power block. Now, originally I said I was going to put it in the center. We just don't have the room, sadly. So it's going to be here, which means it's not very secure. So <laughs> we are doing this knowing that it's not in the best place that it could be. But it's just the nature of the beast. It means if they want to smash it up, they can turn all the power off. Well, that's just how it is. Let's go. This is going to be a medium, uh, medium or even low risk facility. But I'm looking at these type, uh, this size, probably, probably going to go with medium. 
It's just because we need the money. There's an accountant. That means we now have that grant done. We're going to go over to bureaucracy. We're going to research extra grant. We're going to research bank loan. And with the warden, we'll research maintenance. We'll research health and security and psychology. And yeah, let's just let them crack on with that one. We also have another grant. We've got a short and long-term investment. We'll go for the long-term investment because it takes the longest to do. And we're going to go back over to here. Walls and doors and then white walls. So we'll place the entrance to this. Hmm doesn't really matter where we place it does it uh, we could have the, just the entrance on ah well actually we'll place the we'll place the entrance on this side that's a better idea isn't it staff door so we'll say place it there it means that yeah they can't get in from that way that actually makes it a little bit more secure which i'm very happy about so they're going to crack on and do all of that obviously we have to go to foundations building brick and you clicky clicky draggy draggy over the top and then it will infill the center that is a bit of an annoying bug when you build across that it means all of this will be unplanned when we build it but oh well we'll do what we can so we're going to go over to our utilities and then do the power station and we'll place a power station in there we'll place the capacitors along there and across there and this will probably power this section and down and then obviously we'll have the same on the other side to power that for the time being though we're going to run some electrical cable probably probably right across to there and oh do I want to no let's cancel that I, I much prefer to run along here like that like that and then we'll run it up there because that'll have to power all of these rooms and I don't know exactly what's going to be in these rooms so there we go that's all now connected up we will go over to a white wall and we will place the white wall all the way around the outside so from here along up obviously it's a bit of money this quite a bit of money indeed actually but there you are uh, we'll place it actually we'll probably place it right to here because we have to build a reception anywhere so we'll do just that and money is going down a lot faster than I expected so down to there, that's now in. Place in the barred wall. No, uh, barred wall. Never used that before. We could have that as barred wall. Okay. Um, we'll place large yield door in there. Oh, in there, and then in there, and then the visitor door, north and south. We should have another grant done. Uh, yes, we've now got inmate health and well-being. Um, hmm. Medical ward, two doctors, psychologist. Right, we will do that. Simply because it's quite easy to do. So, we are researching the psychologist. Psychology has already been done, actually. We will go for a, another office. So, actually what we'll do is we'll just designate all these as offices. Like so. And then in the rooms we will place the desks. It's not going to cost too much to get these done, so I don't mind. I don't mind placing these in now. It doesn't cost much money at all. There we go. Right. So for the room. Infirmary. There we go. Objects. One medical bed. Like so, we're just trying to get this done. Uh, hire a psychologist. Hire two doctors. There's that grant done. Go ahead and sack both doctors because we're just here for the grants. I will... Hmm. Do we want to get rid of the psychologist? Let's see how much they cost per day. Hmm. 200 per day. So if we sack them, we would... And we don't... Uh, will we get prisoners within 10 days? Uh, five days, rather. No, we won't. So you're gone as well. Sorry about that. Um, it was, to be fair, quite a short job, but um, and not very fulfilling. Where am I, where am I going? Uh, staff. And we will get rid of you, because they don't research anything. Okay, and there we go. They're now gone. I'll probably regret that decision in a moment's time, but there you go. We're going to go back over to bureaucracy and research... What do we want to research? Research groundskeeping, cleaning, prison, labour. We will then hire 
a foreman, one of. You can hire multiples now, but we only need the one. In terms of our grants, we've got a short-term investment, which we will now get. And then we have a... Well, <laughs> we need to build a basic detention centre, which is holding cell, shower, yard, kitchen, canteen, all of that sort of thing. Let me just see if this is secure. So we will place the yard in here. Obviously, these are going to have weights, benches, and bleachers and things like that in there because they're, they're bleachers are now the new thing. So that's now in. That is also not flashing to say it's broken, so this means that this is secure. We will go to foundation, building brick, and then build across there. And then that should just infill the rest of this. It is removing some of the... Oh, no, it's not removing all of this thing. Interesting. And that's now legitimate. Yeah, that's fine. And, oh, it has removed this little bit, though. Okay, fine. So we'll place the walls like that. There we go. And then we'll designate this as a uh, reception. There we go. Tend to do that and that. There we are. So, same again. Office desk right in the centre, like so. We'll have our tables. You could, I could have used small tables, but this is fine. Um, and then also... Mm, it's not highlighting the chair. Chair, office... Right in the centre. Lovely. And then we need to run our power cable across for that as well. So we'll do that. Across to there and then down to there. Preemptively because we know we're going to have metal detectors there. So we might as well place it. Alright. So we now have that on the go. That'll be lit up. We don't yet have the water pump. But it's probably going to go in here. So let's place that in now. So we'll go for uh, utilities. Water pump. And we'll place it in there. And... That means that we'll have to have probably a capacitor there and then we'll place that there and then that connects that up. And we then need to get some more money. We are currently getting uh, 420 per day. However, the slight issue is it's going to take a lot longer for that long-term and short-term investment to finish. It's going to take uh, a couple of days for the short-term and several more for the long-term. So what can we do in the meantime? Well, we can't take out a loan because I didn't research it, I don't think. Uh, yes, we can. We could get 250 That would take us up to about six. Six grand. Can I get the basic detention center with six grand? Hmm. I think so. I think I probably could. Requires holding cell though. And look how dirty that's getting. Uh, also, ah oh yeah. Staff needs. <laughs> uh, do they have needs? Can't see them because we don't have a psychologist. <laughs> Did Sarah would regret that decision. Holding cell max size 5x5. Five five. Darn it. Okay. See this? This is now not reception. Also, why did that not work? Oh, what? That chair is not classed as a chair for the purposes of this becoming a proper room. Right, I guess chairs are going to go on either side then, aren't they? That's now legit. And what we're also going to do is go to rooms, holding cell, get rid of all that, put that in. Uh, toilet and a bench. Bench small, if we need to. We will buy a bench. We'll buy a toilet. Dump that in there, just for Grant's sake. I don't know why Grant cares about it, but it's done anyway. Sorry, that was terrible. Uh, so, kitchen, canteen, and a shower. Right? Easy. So, um, kitchen. Canteen. And a shower. Okay. So, <laughs> this is... This is uh, going a bit far. There's the shower. <laughs> and uh, cooker, fridge. And then serving table, table, and bench. Right. <laughs> uh, exploitation of unintended game mechanics, perhaps? Maybe, maybe. <laughs> I uh, don't have to like it, but it's the way we're getting the money, <laughs> and it's the challenge of it. I mean, you can't, you could just like sell the previous prison and get all the money, but then, well, what's the point in that? Um, right. So, 
And now these are the same. If we didn't get prisoners within five days, uh, it would not be worth it. But I'm not going to fire the guards. I am going to fire the staff. Uh, the cook, sorry. The reason I'm not firing the guards is because there's grants to get things like that. So, cell block A, prison maintenance. That's pretty much done. Yeah, that's pretty much done. So, prison maintenance. One gardener, two janitors. Done. Cell block A. And we'll build the cell blocks. Why not? Wh why not? Why not? Um, you tell me why not. Uh, so, there's probably many reasons, but, you know, let's get this done. We get both done at the same time. And I'll pause it. I will place... I always go, when I'm looking at this, I go, oh, look, there's the, there's the, there's the thing I need. Bad wall. No, it's not. It's definitely not that. It is, uh, I think that's a, the door, but no, that's the door. I can tell it's the door because it says large jail door. So building brick over the top. Same again over here. And it's snowing. Right. So, that is those built shortly. And it's now built. We will put the internal stuff in there. Which means white walls. Oh, hang on. Yeah, white walls. Is that right? Yeah, that's correct. Okay. Do the same on this side. Place these Tetris pieces in. 21 grand. That's fine. Something about that looks wrong. Don't know what it is. Hmm. Anyway. So, rooms, cells. We'll get rid of all that. Uh, dismantle object. There we go. But we'll reuse it, obviously. So, for each of these cells, actually, let's run some power just so we can see what's happening here. Uh, power will probably just run over there. About midway. We will do this. Obviously, this will probably change. That'll probably change because it'll be connected to that one instead. But for the time being, it's fine. So those are in. Uh, lighting looks good. Could do with probably some more lighting, but that's the least of our worries at this stage in the game. So each of these will have a bed and a toilet, and we'll do that. We are going to do them all. Um, we could probably do that way. Yeah, we can. The reason we'll do them all is because we need to get at least 15 for the grant. So there you are. And the toilets can go. Actually, the toilets can go. Yeah, they can go that, that side there. We could have made one and then cloned it, but that would have cloned the lights too, so not what we really want to accomplish. There's that grant. Oh, that was short-term investment. Yes, short-term investment. Uh, Jill Dawn here. And then along here. We'll unpause it. It actually norm it normally helps with building when you unpause it. And there we are. There's that to the end. So there's uh, that sorted. Let's have a quick look. We've got visitation rights. We've got cell block B. Cell block B we won't even be able to complete at this stage. We're going to go for... Hmm. Staff well-being initiative. Yeah. Yeah. And... That's quite doable. Visitation rights. But there's not much money in it. Oh, we need much money. Um, visitation rights. Because the short, the long-term investment will be done at some point anyway. Right, so we have now got a very, very...
very decent start, I think. Um, we have 51 grand, um, 51,710 generic units of currency, 175 per day, plus or minus whatever we're selling. We have two cell blocks, the only cell blocks we have on this plan, you understand. We have the offices in there, they're doing research, we've got the short-term investment done, long-term investment on the go. The staff well-being initiative we can probably do next episode by replanning this and then putting the kitchen and canteen in. Uh, yeah. And then we have to put visitation in. That's obviously, a, well, currently it says hauling cell. We will change that back to a reception because that's what it should be, like so. And then we'll get rid of those. Obviously, flooring we haven't put in. We haven't done any of that sort of thing. That's a futurist problem. Right. I think that's a good start for the building. Next episode, then, we will go ahead and continue on with the grants and probably build at least one of these uh, kitchen and canteen units. We'll get the extra buildings uh, looked at as well and uh, water because currently we don't have any, so we're probably going to end up doing that as well. So there we are. <laughs> Hope you have enjoyed this video. Comments in the comments. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.